Hello humanoids and welcome to another video on the RTB YouTube channel. Today's going to be a bit different as I'm going to be, be going over my top 5 round based Roblox games. Before we start the video I just want to say that this list is my opinion so if you disagree with anything please don't send any hate. However if you do agree with anything on the list or just want us to play any of the following games on the channel leave a comment down below. With that said let's get right into it. So in number 5 we have Murder Mystery 2 or X. Now Murder Mystery is a game where you as the player is assigned a role and have to try and survive the round. If you're an innocent all you have to do is hide and survive. If you're the murderer you have to try and kill all of the innocents without being discovered as the murderer. And if you're the sheriff you have to work with the innocents to find out who the murderer is and shoot him. Number 4 Assassin. Assassin is a game where in each round all players are put into a unique map to kill each other. Every player has a target and an assassin, and you have to be the last man standing by killing your targets and your assassins. Number 3 is Super Bomb Survival. SBS is a game where you have to survive bombs that randomly drop from the sky. A pretty simple concept, but a fun game nonetheless. Number 2 is Dedoxed. Dedoxed is a game where you either play as a hacker or a CEO. Hackers have to hack the power, servers and computers, then get out, while the CEO's job is to capture the hackers. This is a fun one, however it can be extremely hard, as the CEO runs slightly faster than the hackers, so it's pretty hard to escape them once he started chasing you. Before we get into number 1, I have some hon honourable mentions that didn't quite make it onto the list. The first is Incognito, a game where you can either be a criminal or a cop. Criminals have to hide among the crowds, or cops have to locate and kill them. The second is Tower of Hell, a randomised tower obby where it's a race to the top. Each round you get a new randomised tower constructed of many challenging floors. The third is Epic Minigames, where each round you play a new minigame. Some are hard, some are easy, but if you're an OG Roblox player, definitely have, have at least heard of this game before. The final honourable mention is A Very Hungry Pikachu, where you have to take down a giant Pikachu. I'm not joking, look at this thing. Anyway, on to number one, which is Flea Facility. This is a game a bit like Dedoxed, where each round you're either a survivor or the beast. Survivors have to hack computers, then escape, or the beast has to capture survivors and freeze them in a cooling chamber. This game may be fairly old and at times quite easy, but there's a charm to it that will make you want to play for hours on end. Well, I hope you enjoyed my list. Please do comment on the video if you agree or disagree with it. I think it'd be interesting to hear your opinions. And leave a like if you want some more. Also, please do subscribe if you haven't done already. We're trying to hit 50 subs before March. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Uh, and yeah, we'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.